Yes. Now to Kevin Gomer on the backstretch. Thank you, Tom. With me is Greg Kuhn, who is the starter and track superintendent here at the Red Mile. Greg, Lexington's Red Mile, the fastest harness track in the world. Is the track in top shape today? Yes, it is. We put sand on this morning, and we'll cut up a nice cushion, and the trotters should just fly over today. Ready now for the second heat of the Horsemen and Fair World for three-year-old fillies. And remember, in that first heat, it was Fan Hanover, a very easy, impressive winner in 155 and three. She's going to be tough to beat. You think she can be Horse of the Year if she goes on and takes the second heat? I really think so. But then again, we have a little bit of a problem here. We have another filly in the Garnsey stable, Del Megan. If she happens to beat the boys in today's fraternity, she could be Horse of the Year. I think this is an interesting race. Will the gray filly finally beat Fan? She hasn't all year. Coming behind the gate, the three-year-old fillies for the second heat of the Horsemen in Fair World with that purse of 34,000 a mile pace. And in this second heat, they'll go in post position order corresponding to their finish in the first heat. That means Fan Hanover is number one, Watering Can two, Carol Hanover over three in four liberated angel loose news is five rosarium six and silent lisa eight dd skipper was scratched fan hanover the one to beat oh definitely so she beat the boys in the little brown jug and she's just dominated this group of three-year-old pacing fillies fan hanover the prohibitive favorite one to nine for the second heat of the horsemen in fair world here's carl becker here they come They're off and pacing. Watering can grabs the lead. Fan Hanover will be away second. Carol Hanover third. Loose News rushes up fourth. Dropped in fifth. Liberated Angel pacing six. Rosarium and trailing Silent Lisa as that field of Philly slips around the turn, racing toward the quarter mile mark. On the outside, Loose News hunts cover. She'll find it second. Watering can the leader. Fan Hanover third along the rail. Carol Hanover fourth. Racing fifth. Liberated Angel pacing six. Rosarium and trailing Silent Lisa as they drive to the quarter mile mark. They race past that stage and they're on the back stretch with the lead watering can by a length and a half. Second at her back is Loose News. Third, Fan Hanover. There goes Loose News, powering to the outside. The free-legged filly is taking command, leads by a neck, half a length, a length, a length, and a half. Watering can, second, Fan Hanover, third. Carol Hanover, four, Liberated Angel, five. Spacing six, Rosarium, and Silent Lisa can see them all as they race toward the half, led by Loose News. On the move, Fan Hanover. There goes Fan Hanover, driving out a third. They're at the half, 57-1 after a quarter, and 28-4. And to the upper turn being led by Loose News. Fan Hanover on the outside second. Watering can third along the rail. Carol Hanover tips to the outside fourth. Racing fifth, Liberated Angel six, Rosarium. And trailing that field still silent, Lisa as the three-year-olds race past the draw gate. Loose News leads it for Sunny Dancer on the outside. Second is Fan Hanover biding time waiting. Carol Hanover trailing her ready to move as they turn for home with Watering Can second on the inside. Past three quarters. 125, two fifths they're in the lane and coming on fan and on the front end it's still loose news far outside carol hanover and now watering can and fan hanover not closing ground the leader is loose news here comes watering can watering can on the outside coming on rosarium water can watering can takes over on the inside loose news watering can and rosarium watering can 154 Two fifths, watering can. An upset in the second division of the Horsemen in Fair World as they come down the stretch. It's the gray filly this time. Watering can. She sat behind Loose News in a very quick third quarter. And she raced her mile in 54 and two, and that's three fifths of a second off of the world record. Tom Fan Hanover in a very quick third quarter was parked to the outside, and that eliminated her chances in the final of the Horsemen in Fair World. So watering can the upset winner in the second heat. You see the final time. One minute, 54, two fifths. Watering can the winner of the Horseman in Fair World. Stanley, you've been chasing Fan Hanover with this gray filly all summer long, and you finally beat her today. Well, let's say I was just a little bit extra lucky today, and she is a great filly, and she's raced great, but, uh, you know, it's just like the Derby. you got to have a lot of luck, and I had a lot of luck that time. And, but she is a great mare, and, but the other one's just a little bit, you know, a little super great. That's all. She's a great filly. She certainly is. Both of these fillies, so watering can, scoring in 54 and 2, and that is one of the fastest miles ever turned in by a three year old pacing filly. Yes, that's uh, maybe the fastest mile I've ever rode, too. Albatross is 54 and 3, so uh, I think that's probably the fastest mile I've ever gone. Congratulations. Thank you very much.